girl, I'm sorry. Babe? Yeah? Remember I told you I was going out with my bestie, so I'll be back after midnight. Babe, are you leaving me in this house? But you have your friend here. Me, I'm going out with my baby. Love him, please. I love my baby. Help me keep him company, please. That's that's fine. Thank you guys. See you guys later. <laughs> Your best is a guy. As you can see. Hot! Are you sure you're not doing too much for your man? Like that house, is that his? Does he pay rent? For where? Have you seen yourself? Like you could do way better than this man. I think you should break up with him to be honest. Ha! Hello mate. Ha! <laughs> Would have kill a lot. He would like to take me and my friends out, just just the girls. So I'm sorry you guys can't tag along. Mm. Since we're going out and you lot buy yourself like a drink or something, mm. ah! to be honest, I don't know how how much things cost in Lagos. I don't, I don't know. Go on, it's just a little bit more. Thank you. All right then. Let the poor oh, look at you. breathe. You don't suffocate them. And your boyfriend's alright. I know, right? Go on. Come on, chop chop, come spend us some money, babe. Jesus! Hey! Hurry up now, we're already late. Hey! The Christmas are for. Hey, hey, I won't leave my baby for inside for two days. Uh -huh. I want us to go to Abuja for one meeting. I want to go meet to Dumudu. Hey. Dumudu say he won't feature a potable. Hey. Like uh, Charlie Poppy. Hey. But I beg, if I won't do anything, no give a bell. Ah, no, no. Babe, don't you trust me? Wait a minute. Uh, you that I'm linking up with my girlfriend in Abuja. You guys should better use protection. No? What's what I'm gonna do for you? Yeah? Don't give me silicone yash. What's what I'm gonna do for you? Yeah? I have a question. My girlfriend makes seventy thousand dollars at her current job. She went to a job interview today. She calls me and tells me she got the job and she's going to be making a hundred thousand dollars a year. The only problem is her ex from five years ago is the boss of the company. I tell her it's gonna make me uncomfortable knowing that she's gonna be around him all day, every day. I tell her if she takes the job, I'm leaving because I know I'm not gonna be able to handle it. If she loves me and wants to stay with me, she's not gonna take the job and she's gonna go somewhere else. My question is, am I doing too much? Does that make me insecure? If you were her, what would you do? was supposed to take me out today uh -huh. but she left the country with her family and i don't know where she's coming back oh all right don't feel bad just get ready let me take you out <laughs> are you serious Dougie, you told me he been on some positive shit. Ah. why would i know me like the way she works Bestie, all this for me. Sure, it's nothing. Sure. Call me whenever you need me. Ah, bestie, thank you. I have a question. I've been married to my wife for 10 years, and she has a son by someone else that I helped raise. So basically, my stepson. One day, I asked her if I was drowning and her son was drowning, who would she save? And she told me her son. So then she asked me if she was drowning and her son was drowning, who would I save? And I say, her. I would save her. She starts getting upset and tells me I should save her son, not her. I tell her, I only love him because I love you. If we had a kid together and it was my blood, it would be different. I don't have that bond with your son that you have with him. I still love him, but you mean more to me. We are now in the middle of getting a divorce. So my question is, was I wrong for actually telling her how I feel or should I have kept it to myself and told her what sounded nice? If you were me, what would you have told her? 